First edition is learning about a rare virus in North Texas this morning. According to the CDC, someone from Dallas County traveled from Nigeria earlier this month and is currently in the hospital with monkeypox. Here are the facts. Health officials describe it as a more severe case of chickenpox. Symptoms include fever, headache, muscle aches, swollen lymph nodes, chills, and exhaustion. CDC testing reveals the patient has one of the milder strains of monkeypox. Its fatality rate is about one out of every 100 people. There is little risk to the public, though, due to mask requirements in public transit. As you just heard, monkeypox is a rare but potentially serious viral illness. It's in the same family of viruses as smallpox, but causes a milder infection. Prior to the current case, there have been at least six reported monkeypox cases in travelers returning from Nigeria. Dr. Greg Silverman joins us to discuss further. Good morning, Dr. Silverman. Thank you so much for being with us today. Good morning. Good to see you. So what is monkeypox and what causes it? Well, you guys did a pretty good job of that. It's, a, it's the same type of virus that causes smallpox and possibly chickenpox. And remember, smallpox we thought had been eradicated, but it turns out that, that, that this monkeypox is still out there, that there's still viruses that are similar to it out there. Um, generally out of Western Africa, this one they think came out of a man traveling from Nigeria. It, it, it happens if you're exposed to exposed meats or exposed animals that have the virus. Like it's the, the, the term monkeypox came from the idea that it was first found in 1959 in a set of uh, laboratory monkeys. So that's where this thing came from. There was there's been a couple of outbreaks out there otherwise, but nothing really major. And I think the reason that this one got a, a fair amount of play is because we're so sensitive, having gone through the virus that we have now, the COVID that any other viruses out there that sort of pop up are going to get some exposure. What are the uh, treatment options for a monkeypox? Well, I mean, it's it, like any other virus. It's really uh, generally just kind of um, get you through the symptoms. The general symptoms are the same kind of symptoms of any other types of virus, and that is generally muscle aches. You can have swollen lymph nodes. Um, headaches, fevers, kind of a dry cough, those kind of things. This thing is, is harder to get than COVID. The nice part about COVID, if you want to call it nice, was the ability of COVID to spread. It was very simple to spread. Monkeypox is a little bit harder. You have to be either exposed to the type of animal that carries this disease or through large droplets. The thoughts are that the man on this plane, the, the, it, it, people in planes have to wear full face masks so that may not have spread to anybody else. And the CDC is looking into this to see where this, who he came in contact with. And Dr. Silverman, is it fatal? I'm sorry? Is it well, fatal? It, it, it can be fatal. Apparently up to 10% of people are die from this, from monkeypox, but it's hard to say exactly in sort of, you know, in the United States, given the, the proper amount of medical care, it's hard to say to, to sort of, compare what happens in Nigeria, where the medical care in Nigeria is a little bit different than the medical care in the United States. But having said that, yes, it is fatal. Dr. Silverman, thank you so much for being with us today. Have a wonderful week and we'll see you next Monday. Well, thank you.